women's issues during pregnancy could often be brushed aside in favor of the women. And yet the fatigue, nausea, and weight gain I myself experienced caused me much worry. Many times I would have to look into the mirror and tell myself, You're not fat, Eric! You are pregnant! Sam, the baby is missing! Sam, the baby is missing! I need to check on her, she's not in her crib! Where can she be? She can't even walk! Shh, Eric, Shh, the baby is with me. She's right here. I, she was crying a bit, so I, I brought her into bed. <sighs> Sam, why didn't you tell me? Well, you were writing a daddy blog. I didn't want to disturb you. Oh. Besides, I sang to her and she fell right asleep. Maybe you can sing to me and help me fall asleep. I am so wound up about my blog. I'm just bursting with ideas. Uh, yeah, I can see your creative uses are really flowing. Oh, Sam, the, the baby. Sam, uh, might not be good for the baby. It's good for the baby's mother. Yeah. Sam, mm. may, may I ask you a question about the baby? What about the baby? Well, that's just it. Uh, we haven't named the baby. I know we haven't named the baby because we can't agree on a name for the baby. <sighs> I want to call her Ursula. That is the name of a cushion at Ikea. Anita? Curtains. Billy. Bookcase. Look, I'm just looking out for her. How would it look if our baby was named after one of our products? But nobody else would know. But I would know, and every time I looked at my little girl, I would think she's named after a Jenny Lund. Antonia. <sighs> Storage unit. <sighs> I like to think I'm pretty good at coming up with names. I think Lars Erica is a terrific name. Try it in a sentence. Lars Erika? It sounds like a, an allergy medication. No, when you say it like that. Planet or... Lars Erika. Cosmetic procedure. Lars Erika. Science fiction. Lars no. Erika! No, oh, the baby. Lars Erika is just responding to her name. Aren't you, sweetheart? Yeah. I'm sorry, Sam. I'm sorry too, Eric. We'll come up with the perfect name for the baby. One that we can both agree on, and one that people won't think is a couch. <laughs> Say goodbye to the girl in the hand-me-down pearls. Close the door, it's happened all before. You should audition for Ikea's Got Talent. You know, work on your singing and I'll stay home with the baby. Oh, Eric, I would love that. I'd really like to start thinking about my music career again. Well, then it's settled. You will sing for your supper. Okay. Oh, wait, what about the baby? Which one? <laughs> okay, so are we all in agreement on the name? No. I can live with it. It's a funny yet sly reference to a branded talk show sponsored by IKEA. This side up it is. Good work, Yolanda. All right, we got to make sure that we secure the domain name this time. And Yolanda, was that? Jerk off still cyber squatting on easy to assemble. Yes, he is. Hey, go easy on those fish. I gotta keep you in fighting weight. The camera has 10 pounds. Two cameras? That's like 20 pounds. <laughs> 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 Write that down for the monologue. Okay. That's just scribble. Hey, what happened to my Marty joke? If Liza Minnelli and I both slept with you, does that make me gay? Was that <laughs> considered funny in the 90s? You don't think it's funny because it doesn't have the word porn in it or balls. It's not funny, Ileana. How can I put this? Because it's not funny. This is funny. <laughs> I'm being upstaged by a camel. <laughs>